Welcome everyone for another video. Um, this time we're going to talk about cults, structure and danger. Um, um, for the ones who want to see the video in another language, check the other accounts. Um, yeah, let's straight up go into. Well, many think that uh, cults are like some uh, strange groups uh, making strange rituals, uh, what is often also the case. Um, but what we should look at is not only like the stereotype that we have of cults, but also like to see what the whole outcome is. Um, even if they are institute, uh, if they accepted by society, um, it doesn't mean it's not a cult or it's a, a religion or it is uh, something like that. We have really to look into how the whole structure of a cult is so we can recognize the different um, organizations or groups or group thinking uh, of some they really get extreme. You get it. But um, it's not other extreme than uh, what we uh, anyway have with uh, religions, with sport, with fashion, with uh, gaming, with uh, food, uh, with uh, exercising, uh, with uh, music uh, or uh, image, pop star, um, uh, actors, uh, or politic, any kind of uh, organization or movement uh, that is created, we always have to take, uh, uh, pay very much attention uh, of what is going on. Even uh, just the one in France is a very good example how the whole stuff is used and abused. Uh, but finally, every organization, movement, protest, if it's political, um, if it's uh, for the nature, saving Africa, the world, the uh, air, or whatsoever, if it's humanitarian, all these organizations can and most are created, financed, hijacked, manipulated, directed, and uh, used, or uh, abused, uh, recovered. They are. We we have to we have to see as soon as you have a hierarchy in in any kind of this movement groups. Uh, you will have uh, this kind of uh, uh, possibilities that whole stuff is recovered and uh, uh, manipulated, right? So only see the, if people go to protest, uh, they they just are, are for the test. They are agreeing to test what politicians are saying. They just don't agree. <laughs> But uh, finally, it is it, the way everything is is uh, twisted in this world. It is it is the contrary what they do. It's the same with the truth mo truth movement. Uh, it moves uh, the mental, and uh, there is no truth. If it moves the mental, it is just uh, another, another mind control. And uh, before we laugh about the different cults and. Uh, organizations and so on we just have to uh, think about if we ourselves are in any kind of cult or part of a cult uh, and it's not because we are not wearing any kind of foil hat that we are not part of a cult so let's uh, let's look into the structure of uh, uh, of the cult Recruitment, activities, propaganda, control, the group thinking, makers, the members, 
the followers, the dependency, uh, the private sessions, but all what matters really with all this stuff is finally the outcome, the facts, what is going out of the group, what is really changing, is it changing really something and what it is changing, right? So after uh, Wikipedia or the uh, Jesuitpedia uh, um, description, you can pause it and uh, read it if you want. And mostly the claim number one, that they are not a cult. <laughs> And I mean, uh, not a cult, not a not kind of anything, but what we have to see is the whole structure behind. But let's see what a uh, cult really means. It's worship, it's homage, it's uh, cultivation, culture, worship, reverence, uh, to cultivate, yeah? Cultivate is also uh, to cultivate something. It can also be like a... Anyway, if it's worship, if it is submission. But to cultivate is also to plant a seed that is growing uh, uh, in the direction the ones who plant it, right? <laughs> because he decides where, where he has planted and he will condition already the plant to grow instead that the nature or life can choose uh, or man can choose it himself. So for um, a cult, we need a, a leader, we need a guru, uh, a prophet, we need symbols, we need like a temple or a home or a, a place to be with fantasy name, with a philosophy, a religion, a belief, uh, uh, something that you can identify yourself with. And of course, this all have to be written somewhere that the people can read it, that they not only, uh, or that the guru or the priest don't have to talk all the time. Uh, there you have the different mantras, uh, the alms, uh, the um, uh, praying, the praise, the, 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 all the, the life energy rituals that you put into this uh idea or this cult um then you have the followers and uh, these followers have to get in a way get fascinated so what they use is miracles right stuff that happens that they are the only ones who can do it so you get fascinated by the what they are doing what they tell you and um uh, they they have to continue this 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 thing and tell that to 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 everyone, so that they they are really gonna fa be fascinated and and go follow and listen and blind believe the 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 uh, the guru or the leader uh, of this thing yeah, and uh, everyone around is gonna say yeah he could do this and that and of course he will say yeah this is not important and uh, everyone can do it blah blah blah. But finally, uh, uh, if it's stuff that doesn't really fit, then it doesn't fit, right? So uh, for every cult, today is a goal, like uh, uh, spiritual, mentally, uh, finding the universe, uh, finding the nirvana, uh, or the holy land, uh, maybe also a trip on earth that, and to another temple. Uh, and so on. A very important part is the whole uh, private session, what you have in uh, religions, you have that uh, very often, but in cult. Uh, just to say that I take the example of Kumare, that is, um, is a movie, uh, we get deeper into that. Uh, but the private session allows them to blackmail, to, to get information, or, uh, uh, personal stuff about the, these people, so they can use them if they want to leave, um, or to put like the whole cult in jeopardy. They will, they will use private stuff that is is told them because you want to share, you want to learn. So you 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 uh, you share this stuff, and uh, with that uh, they can build rumors 
and uh, of course uh, many things have to be silent and um, and uh, even the ones who just uh, trust blindly uh, they, they will not question this um, uh, and so on so there are different uh, activities that only don't have to be meditation it can be dance it can be movie theater uh, acting uh, yoga gardening music uh, no matter what it don't have to be right it don't have to be because you make garden you have to be in a cult you don't have to be because you make some uh, body exercises you have to make yoga but as soon as you start to make yoga with your body exercises you're already in a cult if you start to make like movie and you have to act like how they do then you're in a cult if you meditate and you get your instruction dance music whatever uh, if if you are like get into a mold and in a stereotype of things then you're already in a cult and all what they want is just to uh, uh, get more people to join the, their ID because they think their ID is just bringing everyone uh, to their um, uh, nirvana. But um, just to show uh, how, how how this functioned with uh, Kumare. It's where I lived, who I knew. But as Kumare, I was nobody. I was an empty vessel. They call me Kumare. 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 Hey, my English isn't that good. And for once, I was capable of anything. When he would focus on the different chakras, it was just on fire. It was very powerful. It was interesting trying to teach a Himalayan yogi master some magic tricks. Oh. Don't do that. But he pulled it off really well. He's fascinating. He wants to fascinate people and show how simple he is and how uh, fun he can be and so on. And this is exactly what the charming do uh, to cast a spell. It's a magic spell. It's magic. It's pure magic. And why did I love being him? So they have to be a recruitment. Uh, you surround yourself with some nice chicks who uh, play priests and. Uh, recruiter uh, of course they are going to tell you they they want you they need you and uh, they will mostly make you think that uh, you need them uh, then you start to trust and then you start to blind follow and uh, get surrounded by by this lie and you take it with you so the propaganda have different forms No matter how you propose this stuff to, to, to the people, and here is just an example out of the Kumari movie. Miracles, motherfucker. <laughs> it's a charm we magic We know spell. the answer is inside, we just need someone to bring it out. And, and of course, propaganda, the books, uh, Facebook, YouTube, uh, and people will just support you, make events, and make propaganda for you. No matter in what kind or in what form, uh, it, it is all part of that uh, cultish behavior, right? So the group thinking is our uh, important part of it, that uh, everybody agrees, but down there they, they think, yeah, but this could be strange. They don't really ask the question until the end because they uh, quickly get uh, bullied and they, they follow and they just follow uh, uh, someone other's ass, right? Um, getting into cult, no matter in what kind of form, through uh, praying, dancing, clothing, uh, it is just, uh, it's just creating a dependency where you always have to go back, uh, need a babysitter, to know what you think, feel, say, what you're gonna do, what you're gonna eat, what you're gonna practice, what you're gonna, uh, what you're gonna wear, and from this the, the whole uh, control about all thoughts, about uh, 
old feelings. What you say, <coughs> what you eat, what you do, uh, and what you wear. And I mean, uh, in this movie, uh, in this example, the outcome can really be uh, uh, really silly, uh, nothing dangerous. This teaching, through myself, to use as a mirror for yourself. You create inside your mind which direction you will go. Easy one. You just use that like this. So that you can calm your energy together and lose some identity. Lose the identity. You lose all that feeling in your body. You begin to remove all the inside. In this example, the end of the movie is that he revealed himself, uh, just have faked uh, a guru. Uh, he's a, um, a documentary uh, movie director and uh, just made this movie up, just made up that he is a guru. And when he revealed himself, uh, people were very, very surprised, but they uh, nothing really bad happened because uh, his whole concept was to become your own guru, right? your own master so uh, he, people laugh and uh, hug him to thank him to to get fooled but uh, to see that they don't need any guru to uh, to to continue so uh, everything that matters is in the outcome yeah in others uh, cults uh, the outcome is uh, way different uh, as you can see with uh, osho or uh, uh, bhagwan yeah he was uh, uh fascinated by occult and hypnosis uh obsessed with dead and sex inspired by george gurdjieff uh who was also just like another charismatic hypnot hypnotist carpenter trader russian spy and mystical extraordinaire, uh, extraordinaire. so he was like a, a kind of a mystic um occult uh, inspired so that is the the basic of uh, what what he did so first outcome just to buy like a couple of rolls royce is just um, one of the outcome but uh, other extremes are, are, are way different yeah i mean uh, they get really obsessed by this whole cult stuff submission uh to really extremes that people are uh, like i mean what we have saw in the other movie and uh, this is just you know what have to be done what have to be done to bring people to such extremes right and uh today if we see the different stuff that happened that was still uh osho and the Bhagwan cult, yeah. And the place is now owned by the state <coughs> to make a holiday uh, camp for, for, for youngers, yeah. <laughs> Nothing else is just like government organized, but it's ex exactly the same thing and on the same place, exactly the same place. Uh, if you see the, the Bhagwan movie, uh, you will see, you, you will see uh, how, how dirty that that thing got uh, manipulative and everything that is exactly the same so um in other cults the ending was very much worse um in different places uh, anywhere the cults always get uh, very dirty in the ending yeah so no matter what the, the the cult is, it is always a manipulation that people don't even comprehend how they get there, right? Uh, once they're in, they don't know how to break away and nothing is done that you can break away because it, everything is, uh, they have secrets about you. They will reveal uh, blah, blah, blah. Um, they will blackmail you. They will put you really in a in difficult thing that you that you can go away and you will feel very guilty alone 
because they they mostly what what is kind of called do they really uh, take you out of, of of everything even if the whole world is completely shitty I mean we we have to deal with people around us we can't just isolate ourselves and uh, doing uh, in a way that we are not uh, there. So these cults uh, happen everywhere in the world uh, with different charismatic leaders who really get uh, silly in the end. Uh, also women's um, different places, very nasty stuff. But the cult is always the same. You have the guru, you have the name, you have the place, you have the followers, you have the miracles. You have the, the literature, you have the symbols, you have the philosophy, the different uh, mantras, ohms, uh, rituals, uh, uh, sim, uh, like um, a talisman or like uh, whatever, it's always the same. And of course you have the goal. Uh, and in all these cults, this always is exactly the same. And what counts is really the outcome, because if we watch these uh, organized religions uh, or accepted even religions, then it's just exactly the same structure, um, no matter what. And the outcome of this is war, conflict, uh, division, uh murder massacre um slaughter um uh, no matter the culture there's always the same outcome and this is exactly the cultish behavior we all uh trained to 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 live in then of course we have the the new cage uh, new age uh, just uh, like going out of a cage to get in a in a better cage esoteric symbolism uh all the horoscope all the uh, anniversary all the all that stuff uh, date uh, vacation holidays related they are all uh to this pagan or this uh, uh magic or witchcraft and all leads back to the all seeing eye Lorem ipsums means roughly pain itself. So no matter what kind of cult or belief or, 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 or thing you have, it will all lead exactly to itself, just to to this um, ego, this self, like life destroying ideologies. Yeah. So even scientism, it's the hugest religion today. They just believe blindly anything what it comes. Only, but if you really uh, challenge them and ask them some questions, or even if they have, if you listen really to their explanations, um, then you really just, yeah, I mean, there's, you have to laugh, right? So, um, so, so, so you spin, you know, when you spin pizza dough, it kind of flattens out, yeah, it gets wider in the middle, and so Earth throughout its life, even when it formed, it was spinning, and it got a little wider at the equator than it does at the poles. So it's not actually a sphere. It's an it's oblate. And officially it's an oblate spheroid. That's what we call it. But not only that, it's slightly wider below the equator than above the equator. A little chubbier. A little chubbier. Yeah. Chubby is a good way. It's like pear shaped. Pear shaped. Pear shaped. Pear shaped. Yeah. They really can't make their mind up yeah, if it's pear shaped. Why yeah, they have a uh, show only the sphere. And or even like the whole science about the creation of Earth and the universe, uh, the best explanation uh, they get is this one. The, the whole Big Bang was. It just get uh, more silly and silly, and uh, but the, the the problem is that scientists they are like the new messiahs, right? They any kind of what the, the science or the the um, 
the specialist uh, reveal it is just uh, granted yeah any kind of theory is just accepted and uh, even if there's no proof whatsoever uh, but people forget that science finally may create bombs uh, completely confuse life itself pollute it um, analyze it um, try to 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 uh, make interpretation how life really works and um, getting into laboratory, uh, claiming to go, uh, I don't know where, spending billions uh, just for some uh, computer generated pictures. <coughs> but the outcome uh, is also pollution, uh, war, hunger, people don't have food destruction, uh, illness, uh, and desertification, right? Uh, it's like silly to believe that uh, we, with all this, we, we change the global uh, uh, temperature. It is the local temperature that we, we change. Of course, if uh, like all the fields are, are desertic, if, if they create the extremes weather, if they make all this kind of bullshit, cutting trees in the street, in the city, uh, the more concrete, yeah, of course, it gets hotter locally. Yeah. So uh, this whole climate, uh, global climate cult is, uh, uh, of course, uh, perfect with, uh, with uh, the, the same, the same that the Nazis already used uh, or Mao used with the Red Army. This is all the cult. Yeah. This is all uh, Thing that is finally in cult and just watch the followers. And, uh, and there is no end for this, yeah? There is really no end for uh, for uh, uh, I, I mean, they, they, once somebody accept any kind of, um, any kind of cult, then, then it's no limit to it. That is what I want to say. But, uh, cult is also in different forms. Like also, uh, we just can, uh, watch, uh, what's happening to Apple iPhone and I'm the one, uh, who, who use it. Um, I, I was in that kind of cult. I definitely recognize the cult and uh, do not anymore agree with all that with all where, where it goes because I, I i know where it goes today i mean we are going into a digital world where everything becomes digital and life just gets destroyed by the same way people get uh, divided uh, isolated narcissistic uh, psycho zombies and the outcome is really uh, bad for health. Uh, everybody knows it. We knows it from the beginning. I also, I have, I, I used it. I defend it before today. I, I definitely do not defend it anymore. So maybe uh, in a moment we just have to uh, maybe accept that the whole world is fucking cold and that we are all in it. So, uh, um, I, I have seen it. I have seen it uh, uh, since long time. I didn't comprehend why and how and how deep I myself I was in it. But one time we just have to accept it that the whole society have a name, have a temple, have gurus or leaders, have uh, miracles, uh, beliefs, have uh, the rules, regulation, the literature, the the philosophy, <laughs> the symbols, uh, everything is there. Yeah, we have uh, nations, patriotism, people are ready to die for the country, people are ready to uh, spend their money, their energy for any kind of rich motherfuckers. Uh, others are completely uh, obsessed by their, by their own leaders, their own slave drivers. Yeah. Um, but this also can happen in any kind of uh, music event. I fully agree. 
and I, I know also why I I don't participate in that scale uh, uh, there anymore. I'm too honest today to get that kind of amount of followers who will blindly follow just everything what uh, uh, what we are doing. We have. We have, and as soon as I get the chance to tell them that they don't have to follow like that, I do it. So, yeah, the whole world is a lie uh, and a cult, yeah, because it still functions like that. And um, I definitely hope, uh, or I, yeah, I do everything that people don't follow me, because everything what you're going to see is my ass, right? But we have to ask ourselves, I was caught up in cults uh, where the structure exactly and I had the chance to observe it and recognize it myself and we have to ask ourselves in what kind of cult or how many or how deep we are in any kind of these cults so thanks for watching and see you soon